Welcome back to Front the Bench, everybody. As always, it's Eric, and today we're back with another opening. It's going to be 2021-2022 Stature Hockey. This box costs $175, $180 Canadian right now. Um, it is a hobby box. It is only one pack. There's only one pack in this small, tiny little box. It's about the size of my hand. Uh, and you're going to get one on-card auto. You're also going to get some numbered cards in that. There is veterans. There are legends. There are rookies. Uh, you are missing Quinn Byfield, Spencer Knight, Cole Sillinger, and Cole Caulfield from the autograph set for this. But Upper Deck has come out since my last video, and I also did another video explaining the whole redemption process. Uh, if you pull a Nick Suzuki, certain Nick Suzuki cards, uh, you can redeem them for a Cole Caulfield autograph that's numbered, could even be the one of one patch auto. So it's pretty crazy, but I'm gonna turn the camera around. I decided, you know what, I did pretty good on the first box with a couple of these cards, including a Connor McDavid out of 149. That I'd give it another go. Uh, big hit obviously being that Martin Brodeur, legendary heights out of five on card auto. So once again, thought I'd give it another go. Once said here's single pack like i said in every case you seem to get one patch card per case so we'll see if we get this i'm just gonna put that over here one patch card per case is what it seems like it is from the breaks that i've watched no patch card in this so this is your eight cards gonna get the decoy going I drew up the decoy before we, uh, before I started this video. You're also gonna get some rookie cards. You can get some base cards. That's fine. We'll do the base first. We hit them last time. That might be a good sign again. We hit Leon Dreisaitl. We'll just go to the back and pull the next. Nope. 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 Auto card. Stay up. Thank you. Back we have Ivan Prosvetov. So of all of these you get in the back, kind of one insert card. Sometimes it's these uh, rookie excellence cards. Sometimes you get other stuff, but here we go. Ivan Prosvetov is starting us off. He said, once again, thicker stock than what your typical young guns or any of that stuff is. These are not numbered the back card. They are just a basic card you already saw the next one but we'll get them out here i'm not good with these one boxers we got leon dry like i said i actually hit that this exact same card uh base and all last time so maybe that's a good uh good a good sign for us next base brent burns so that's a little different leon was our second card last time but here we go brent burns uh, there's a grading submission video that I'm should be putting up. I was gonna put it up uh, for this Sunday when you guys are watching this, but decided I'd put this up instead. But there's a grading submission video and there's a nice card of his that I'm sending off in that whole thing. So next we're getting into the numbered cards. We're gonna pick this up a little bit. So our rookie is David Ference. Which, once again, sometimes this works out in our favor. Last time it was um, uh, Jacob Bernard Docker. So not a big name, but these are numbered. So this is out of 399. So David Ference, rookie out of 399. Come on. He up a little bit here. There we go. Mort Cider. You got the Mo Cider out of 149. It's a nice hit. Mo Sider. Haven't seen a ton of him pulled from this. Um, I haven't seen a ton. Of, well, I guess a lot of the. I've seen some nasty patches for some of the veteran. I saw like a Lidstrom out of two, I think it was, um, from Breezy Breaks. I saw him pull that. So Breaker's been loving this product. Um, they just. They've been going through it like crazy just because it's. It seems to be a really well-priced product, um, which is the big thing. It's just, I think this is the price where Platinum should have been, this 175, 180. 
stature is kind of at it and so far so good for a lot of people uh next up there we go we got nate dog nathan mckinnon this is 99 out of 99 or is that yeah it must be 99 right no no it's 66 so this would be the image variation i am wrong 66 out of 66 Nathan McKinnon, that's going to be a little nice little PC card for me. So there we go. We'll throw him up there too. Who cares about covering up Adam Beckman? Uh, next up, numbered. This is numbered. <laughs> Why do we have to hit two of this guy? David Ferrance. He is number 11 out of 33. Why is that our low-numbered rookie? Ugh, that is gross. <laughs> uh, couldn't be Tomasino. Couldn't be that at least. No? Um, before I get into this last thing, if you guys are looking through here, 99, I'll talk about it. Nick Suzuki, uh, the cards I was talking about, you can redeem them for Cole Caulfield. There's a program. If you go to upperdeckblog.com, uh, you'll find it there. It's a Cole Caulfield redemption thing. For stature, if you hit a Nick Suzuki card number two out of 99, 66, or 33, you can send those cards in and get a Cole Caulfield auto. There's a huge list of them there. All different numbers, there's patch cards, everything else. I think they're just literally just, you could get a patch card 101 for an out of 99 Nick Suzuki. So just keep that in mind. Anybody, if you guys are opening this product or you see any of your friends opening product and they're like, ah, oh, just I hit a Nick Suzuki, whatever. Could be a huge card. Uh, there's some on eBay um, that are going for crazy amounts. So last card. Thank you guys for watching. You guys having it, hit the like, hit the subscribe. Um, I appreciate you guys watching as always. Uh, means a lot. Uh, follow me on Instagram if you guys haven't yet. You guys would have seen that I picked up this box the other day. And I think it's just a base out of 199. Not what you want to see. We got the, so this would be the base. So we got the team. We'll see what team it is first. We'll slow roll this. Might as well. Kings, that's not what you want to see. So this would be Kupari or Sean Dersey. Sean Dersey, womp, womp, womp. So not to say I'm superstitious, but the guy that got me the last box, he was there at the shop. And I'm not saying I'm blaming Tommy because he grabbed me this box, but I'm... I'm, I'm blaming Tommy. So, still not a bad box. Uh, like I said, you get the McKinnon for me. Got a Mo Cider. Um, but the auto, obviously just lacking in. You get just kind of a base numbered. So, 005, that's reverse jersey number. 005, you know, zero five, fifty. 50. Uh, uh. Um, with, with a headman behind or oh, that's Pat Maroon behind him. Um, all right, Sean Dersey, rookie auto. That's again, not the guy you want to see, but that's just the way it works. Sometimes I feel like this is just a decent product. If you want to just rip something fun, like I love platinum and I was really enjoying platinum, but this is $75 Canadian cheaper than platinum. It's it's hard to it's hard to compare. Um, yes, platinum you get more cards and this and that you know, and this is really you get two hits, maybe three hits out of it. One auto, it's you know, there's lots of obviously in that you can get uh, other stuff, but I just think this is a decent product. Even though obviously this box with two David Ferrances and a Sean Dersey and a Prozvetov. As some of our hits, uh, I think even with all that, I still think it's not a bad a bad box. It's a gamble no matter what, whenever you open up a box. 
1000%. Um, but you can also hit stuff like that in the back, which kind of makes a big difference for the price point. So um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Like I said, hit that like, hit the subscribe. I appreciate all the comments and the likes and the thumbs up and everything else on this. Um, and let me know what you, if you guys are liking this product. If there's another product you're more excited for coming up, if there's another product, but a lot of people are saying this is the product of the year. Um, so let's hear for your guys' opinions. Is that the case? Is this the product of the year? Sign off, sound off in the comments. So hope everyone enjoys the rest of their weekend. And for Eric from the bench, we'll talk to you guys later. Bye guys.